It's good to have you back. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome on in, drop a thumbs up. Here's a video and to start off the Halloween season just right. A couple of kids are by themselves inside a house when they captured this terrifying footage. Ines de la Cruz, who suggested the video, writes, a couple of siblings were alone inside their grandparents' house when something extremely creepy was caught on camera by one of them. This Ow! is what they caught. Ow! This is gonna Estamos be aquí en la casa de mi bisabuela. Se fue la... We're here at my great, great, great grandparents' house and the lights went out. Yo, should I actually keep my lights off? I'm not sure, man. Hey! Se fue la luz. Oh, damn, the light. Eh, esa es la casi. Porque, y mi mamá. Okay. Espérense. I need to go pee, he says. Mi mamá y mi abuela se fueron al Oxxo a comprar velas por eso. Por lo que pasó de que se fue la luz. Y pues. Estamos aquí, esas son las... Mi abuelito, espérense, ¿Listo? no sean chillones. No vamos a, no va a pasar nada. Y esas son las cenizas de mi bisabuelo, porque pues desgraciadamente él ya falleció. And these are the ashes y, of my great y, y el baño Damn. está allá. El baño, mi hermano quiere hacer pipí, pero el baño está my allá. Pee, mi abuelo necesita que cuidáramos. What? That was... Was that a chihuahua? Oh god damn! Voldemort, is that you? Yo, that was probably Voldemort, man. Yo, I should nos, not be. Mi abuelo nos dijo que cuidáramos aquí su casa en lo que ellos iban. Pero, I'm scared that my grandmother. Hold on. Pero pues. But the problem is that we don't know what's over there. No sabemos. Es... Yo, these eyes be creeping me out, but probably like dogs or cats, pues... right? Hey. No, tengan miedo. Like you see, this is probably just normal lights, I think. But no still, nada. creeping me Abuelito, out. ¿estás aquí? Grandpa, ¿Sí? are you over there? Oh damn! Vaya, 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 vaya. Entre nosotros. Somos. Show yourself. Hands up in the air. <laughs> what the? What was that? Yo, okay, I gotta turn on these lights, bro. I'm gonna... I'm gonna... Someone pussy or out, something bro. is hiding in what appears to be... I'm gonna pussy way out, bro. Like, that's, uh... Like, turning the lights off. It, hey, shed, when suddenly, the thing inside comes flying out and scares the living daylights out of the children. Talk about traumatic childhood experiences. This is definitely one of them. Now, based on this last scene, it could be that the shadowy apparition is in fact some sort of animal that was taking shelter inside the shed. What appears to be an apparition may actually be a bird or a bat, as it seems to come flying out of the shed. It looks like a garbage bag, right? However, this doesn't explain the shadowy figure that was seen early in the video. Whatever this is, it doesn't seem to be any kind of bat or bird, let alone an animal. Most viewers think that this may have been a malevolent entity seeking to do harm. As with all videos, I leave this one open to interpretation. Was a ghost caught on camera? Or was something else entirely different caught instead? Yeah, I, I don't know, man. Should I keep the lights off? Uh, I don't know. It's kind of actually bad. The atmosphere kind of gets... Like number five. No, I'm gonna the following turn video shows footage of a barber shop during business hours when suddenly all the barbers inside the shop encounter something beyond belief. What? Barber T had. Yo, can a brother get like a haircut or something? Obtain this recording from the security camera inside the shop after experiencing this creepy encounter. Here's the footage that was posted by him, along with the text-to-speech voice explaining the video's events. Be sure to look closely for this one. As something else happens that a lot of viewers missed the first time, oh, take a look. Okay, a lot of viewers missed the first time. So we just realized the barbershop is haunted. Hey! I didn't notice the door moved at first. I gotta Pay attention careful. to the door. Okay, the door opened. Nobody noticed at first. And then they did. Now they are doing it. And then it shut down as they were watching it. It was Dang. all jokes and giggles until... My boy John was super spooked, and so was I. My boy. 
So homeboy. The shop is for sale now. If someone is interested. A door all of a sudden opens on its own and then promptly closes itself seconds later. It continues to do this until stopping about a minute later. The barbers were left spooked, as seen on camera. Now something else happens in this video that you might have missed. There are like so many barbers and homies like, yo, bruh, man, stop looking at the door, man, just uh, cut the hair, bruh. At the start of the video, we see the door opening for the first time. It is around this time, though, that a transparent figure passes by the TV. Oh, damn. Whatever this is, viewers believe that it may be responsible for the strange activity. But things were only getting started because what happens next is just downright creepy. An hour later, one of the barbers approaches the door when the following happens. Uh -oh, hey. What you're about to see is some aggressive paranormal activity. Yo, why you kick the door like that, bruh? Like, why you kick the door, bruh? bruh? Just open it like a normal human. It's your shop. Hey, okay, it's gonna be bad. I think that chair might jump out. I really something. didn't want to touch the door handle. Okay, I get it. Wow! Shut! Sit down! Sit down! Sit down! Down! Everybody on the floor! On the floor! Everybody on the floor! Look at everyone's reaction. I My pulled guy. up the camera angle from the back room, and everything was thrown everywhere. Bruh. Like, all these homies be like... Like most viewers, Barber T doesn't know what to make of this. Now, it could be that a draft was responsible for the door's movement, but if that were the case, then the door would follow a somewhat consistent pattern of opening and closing. This isn't the case here, as it opens and closes as though someone or something is doing this. <laughs> but, like... Yeah, I don't know, man. I find it kind of funny, at least in this area, because there's so many people in here and... Always. It's up to you to decide as to what this might be. I don't ghost know. Ghost or not. Feel free to let me know what you think. Don't ghosts have a policy to not show up when there are like multiple people around? You you know what I mean? Because there's so many people here. There's so many people. Don't they have a policy? Especially when the lights are on. I don't know, man. Maybe if the lights were kind of like off like uh, that, maybe then it would be kind of understandable. But you know what I mean, right? Like, I don't know. Think. I don't know about that. Number four. This next video was suggested by Luna Moon, who had found a video that's been keeping her up at night. Luna writes, A father takes out his phone and begins to record a playhouse tent that he bought for his daughter. All appears to be normal, until the father sees something inside the tent, causing him to flee out of the room and end the recording immediately. This is what he caught. Oh, damn, son. I bought a castle for my daughter and she never leaves it. It's really nice. It has a window and... Hey! What? What just happened? Whoa. As the father walks over to the side of the tent, he sees what appears to be someone hiding inside. But, as soon as he pans back to the tent's entrance... Bro, that's messed up! That's messed the up. figure is no chill. longer there. Naturally, the father ran out of the room and ended the recording. Now uh, this one's hard to explain. Nothing appears to have caused the blind. You think it's uh, legit? You think it's fake? Because the way he moved back, we saw his legs, right? Or 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 maybe he's a good actor, Hollywood acting maybe. But the way he just like moved back, he, his first reaction, his camera went down, right? That's like normal whenever you something crazy is happening and whenever you're scared because it's a uh, because whenever something bad happens, that's when people start pulling their camera out. But whenever they're like really terrified and scared, the second they will do the the first thing they will do is put the camera down and they will start to move back or run even. And that's kind of like what happens. So I feel like that's like natural instinct. That's why I'm kind of believing that this might actually be legit or he might be a good actor and he faked that out. Blanket to rise on its own and appear as though someone were hiding underneath it. The father believes that the playhouse belonged to a child who is now deceased and whose spirit continues to play inside. Although Man. Luna is a skeptic, she too believes in this notion. But if it weren't for the photo the father had taken the next day, she would not have believed him. In this photo, something really creepy is captured. The father oh, had taken a picture of the playhouse to show his wife, hey. and out of nowhere, 
He can't. Bro, I saw that. I saw that. Damn, that's an eye. But that seems like a full blown woman. Captures like, what face. appears to be a, a child peering through the room's window. Doesn't look like a child, but can it be though? Can I guess? Yeah, but doesn't. No. Like. Like, bruh. Mind you, though, that the father lives on the 15th floor of an apartment complex with no balcony outside of this room. Now that's creepy. As always, what are your thoughts on this? Feel free to share. If you caught something creepy on camera, mm. or your if there's thoughts, what you feel, what you, how you feel, ghost videos you'd like me to check out at gmail.com. YouTuber Yamaku uploaded the following video after hearing strange noises from inside his home. Japanese. It goes without saying, but the following clip is pretty creepy. Yamaku oh, has been capturing hey, 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 yo, it's Japanese, I think this is gonna be bad, bro. I gotta actually footage of poltergeist prepare. activity taking place inside his home. From an object being thrown to the ground to a door closing on its own, viewers are certain that Yamaku has captured footage of something unexplainable. But the most chilling incident has to be one of his recent uploads in which Yamaku captures the following footage. This is what he caught. I don't like this. Okay, I'm already scared. Like, I. Knocks on the door. One round fired. Okay, nobody's here. Boy! He's around, still hearing it. He's still hearing it. Oh, damn, son. I don't know why, but I'm already, like, freaked out, though. There's all these videos like that that... Oh, hey, baby, baby. Okay, nobody... Yeah, 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 yeah. Yo, why you want... No, okay, nothing. So far, clear, 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 clear. All clear. Oh, don't, don't do it. I'm not looking. Okay, not clear. Yamaku clear, captures clear. what sounds like someone tapping on the bathroom window. Yamaku thinks that the pipes inside his bathroom walls might have to do something with this. But then one night, in another video, he captures something that seems oh, okay. to suggest otherwise. Yamaku is recording himself lighting an incense candle when the following happens. Oh, snap. There is more. But there is more. I don't know. There is nothing like scary. I know it's a little creepy, like the knocks, but on its own, there's nothing too bad. But why is this video more scary than the other ones? So, toilet. That's where the problem is at. Okay, the window's bad. Looking kind of bad. I don't don't look at the windows. He said he will capture something. Okay, put that. He put... Viewers believe that he may be dealing with something supernatural. Yamaku has yet to upload more videos on the strange encounter. Yamaku. But for now... It's up to you to decide if this is genuine footage of something paranormal or not. Whether Yamaki. ghost or not, the video itself is pretty creepy. Yeah, ye, ye. Yamaku be crazy, man. Number two, boys. Number two. Deja J submitted the following photo and writes, In this picture, two children are leaning against a mirror. The mother of the children saw this as a perfect opportunity to take a photo of them. But when she did, she was horrified by what she had caught in the photograph. She had never captured anything like this before. Damn. This is the photo she took. This? Okay, this is the photo. Uh, don't wanna misfire. Don't wanna misfire. Damn, those look, look at those eyes, bro. Look at those eyes. Thoughts on this one? Thoughts on this one? Has this ever happened to you or something like that has? I hope not. I, I don't wish something like that to anyone. But any any of you had like experiences like that? Because that's like really like creepy. Imagine you take a picture and later on you review. Because sometimes we have seen moments like that, right? We have seen videos like that before where there's someone clearly in the, the back. 
but their face is like half cut something distorted right it might have been a tree but you know it looks like a face whatever but here there are no trees she's inside there are two kids moms are on top there taking a picture wholesome picture right and then she comes there and photo bombs the, the <laughs> photo bombs Bruh. right and you clearly see there but damn man can it be something else but our mind is playing tricks where we're just seeing what's the actual phobia name is it a phobia i'm not even sure pareidolia is that what it's called where it's not a face but your mind thinks it's a face but it's not a face it's just that your mind is making that up it's not clear if the mother and her two children were the only ones present in the room at which the photo was taken yeah but even if she out. stated that she had someone over during this time it would be hard to believe as that someone doesn't appear to be a person whatever this is it's definitely creepy and even without sufficient context the photo is still nonetheless pretty disturbing yeah talk about nightmare fuel this is the stuff of nightmares damn i don't know like if you're watching this at night good luck man good luck man i'm sorry but uh good luck sleeping <laughs> Number a family one. is celebrating a birthday when something disturbing is caught on camera. King Grich submitted the following video and writes, In 2013, the Paris family was celebrating a birthday at their home. It was just the five of them, as evident in the video. But after looking back at the video, it appears that someone else had been there. Here's the footage that was taken at the party. Okay, there are a lot of kids there. I, I don't want to raise my weapon. Someone was clearly there. What? Yeah, I feel like there is someone. I don't see it, but I kind of feel it now that you said it. Oh, there. Are we going to see like a shadow? Oh, yeah, 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 Bruh, it's like straight, walking straight and fast. Hey, and the lights turn off. The silhouette of a child passes by in the background. The Paris family was sure that no one else was there except the five of them, or so they thought. It appears that someone else had made it to the party. Now what's even more strange about the supposed child is the way it passes by. It moves quickly and appears to be floating above ground as it does so. Yeah. The way it passes seems- It doesn't look like that it's walking on legs because when you walk, you have a little bit of that movement on the shoulder, right? It's just going straight, like just straight line as though it's not walking, but kind of like floating. It's very unnatural. Yeah. The Paris family can't seem to explain this, but maybe you can. Yeah, maybe you can. Like with yeah. most videos, this one remains a mystery. Damn, but ladies and gentlemen, click on this video on the screen. After all, you might not be able to sleep, so why not watch another one?